Mabel John, the first female solo artist signed by Motown, has died at 91. The veteran Rand B. singer scored a hit in 1966 with Your Good Thing, is about to end. She passed away at her home in Los Angeles on Thursday, August 25, 2022. A cause death has not yet been released. Her nephew Kevin John said, We loved her and she was a kind person, Kevin John said of his aunt, who was the older sister of Rand B. star Little Willie John. In addition to being the first solo female artist signed to Motown, then Tamla, Mabel John also recorded hit songs for Stax Records and was a singer in Ray Charles Roulette's backing band. She entertained her fans all over the world with her brilliant singing throughout her career with her net worth at $2 million. John was born in Bastrop, Louisiana, on November 3, 1930. She was an American vocalist and the first female artist signed to Barry Gordy Jr.'s Motown Records, then Tamla Records. Mabel was the oldest of nine children. She has six younger brothers and two sisters. Her family moved to Arkansas when she was a child. She attended Cleveland Intermediate School before transferring to Pershing High School. After graduating, John worked as an insurance representative at Friendship Mutual Insurance Agency, which was owned by Barry Gordy's mother, Bertha. She eventually left the company and enrolled at Lewis Business College. She was signed to United Artists in her early days in the music industry, and eventually became the first female solo artist signed to Gordy's own label, Tamla. She released her first single, Who Wouldn't Love a Man Like That in 1960, and she never looked back. Some of her best songs include, Your Good Thing Is About To End, Don't Hit Me No More, Don't Get Caught, You Made A Fool Out Of Me, and Same Time Same Place, among many others. Mabel will be missed by many of her fans all over the world. To the fans, family, and friends, we condole with you. May her soul rest in peace. Like comment, share, and subscribe to our channel for more videos every day.